Alright, uh, we are now on, what is this, week five? Yeah, week four I did terrible. But a lot of people did terrible too. So I did okay then. So just remember that. I didn't even do the numbers. I think it was like eight games out of 16. Yeah, because this is the first week of uh, bye weeks. Because weeks cost so much you have to buy them. Anyways, all right. We're going to start with uh, week five. Uh, we got 14 games this week, so it's going to be a little bit quicker. All right, let's get this rundown started. Starting off, we got the Patriots and the Broncos. Well, let's see. Uh, Broncos. Wait. It's not the Broncos. It's Buccaneers. Oops. A little bit of difference there. So, Patriots and Buccaneers. It's abbreviated, so, you know, it just beat. Anyways. Uh, Patriots and Buccaneers. Patriots, Buccaneers. Buccaneers have swords and stuff, and they're on boats. Patriots, they can be on boats too. They got muskets at least, right? We're going with the Patriots. Yes, I know. Patriots haven't been doing that great. It's almost like something happened between last year and this year. Uh, 49ers and Colts. So we got miners and little horses. Miners use little horses, I mean, like the little miniature ponies, you know, in the mines back in the day. They go back and forth, so they're going to dominate the colts. Yep, that's what miners do, Dom dominate little horses. Take that however you want. All right, the Packers and the Cowboys. So we've got people that put stuff in boxes, and then we have people riding on horses, shooting guns in the air. That's a tough one. I mean, that's, which one's kind of more manlier? I mean, cowboys in a way, but then again, a more realistic of a job as a packer. So if they're going to go at it and fight each other, I mean, both of them take a lot of work. Both of them are pretty strong, but the cowboys carry guns around. Guns, you know, that's a great equalizer. All right, the Bills and Bengals. Uh, let's see, Bengal Tiger, Bill is a Buffalo, Buffalo is a Bison, you got the Water Buffalo, that get eaten by Bengal Tigers, so we're going to go with the Bengals. Alright, Jets first the Browns, I mean, if you fly on a jet fast enough, you might brown your pants. <laughs> Just saying. Alright, but... I mean, like we've said, the Browns are dogs. And Jets in the air. I still gotta go with the Jets. One of these days they're gonna work out for me, I think. Alright. Panthers and Lions. Ooh, we got two. We got a cat fight. Ooh, brown. So you got the Panther. I'm looking at it. It's got big old claws. The Lions got the big old freaking teeth and claws. And the lions are the king of the jungle. The panther lives in the jungle. So we're going with the lions. Alright, Cardinals versus Eagles. We got two bird teams going to each other. But it's an eagle and it's a cardinal. Cardinals will be a red bird. Eagles, no matter what kind of eagle, it's a lot bigger than a little red bird. So, eagle. I mean, eagles are made to fight in the sky. You know, cardinals are made to fly around and eat seeds. Just saying. Jaguars and Steelers. This is a tough one because you got the Jaguars. They're versing the Steelers. One of these days I'm going to figure out which one means home and which one's the away team, but we'll worry about that later. All right, Jaguars and Steelers. Steelers, Ironworkers. Jaguars is a cat. Ironworker. I'm going with the, going with the Jaguars on this one. I think they're going to they're gonna go in there and take them out. All right, Seahawks and Rams. That's another, that's another iffy. Nope. First thing that pops in my head is that, that Seahawk swooping down, that ram, just, pfft, just headbutting that thing, just knocking it out of the freaking sky. We're going with the Rams. All right, Ravens and the Raiders. All right, so we got a flock of Ravens coming down, and they're attacking the Raiders. The Raiders, they're going to get all their shit and start swinging swords and stuff and stabbing and... Yeah, I see a lot of Raiders, and I see them being able to overcome the Ravens. Sorry, Raven fans. I know at least one. 
All right, Chiefs and the Texans. So we got some Indians and we got some Texans. And I think they've already had this battle a few times throughout history, so we're going to stick with the Texans. All right, Titans and Dolphins. Okay, that's pretty simple. I mean, Titans, you got the God thing, and you got a Dolphin. I mean, yeah, Dolphins are smart, but it's Dolphin. Sorry. One with Titans. All right, Chargers versus the Giants. Ooh, man, some lightning bolts coming down. And a Giants already tall. So what's that mean? I mean, you got something tall out in the freaking field. It's an easy target for lightning. Chargers, that's a freaking no-brainer. And now we have our Monday night game, Vikings versus the Bears. Well, the Vikings wear Bears as clothes. Can it get any simpler than that? I mean, they're fighting their clothes. They're going to go in there and they're going to take those bears out. They're going to skin them. And they're going to throw them over them and stay warm. It's not the coat out, but, you know, maybe they're, you know, they run cold and they, they like being warm during the fall. Or maybe it's way up north. I don't know. The game could be anywhere. All right, so we're going with the Vikings on that one. Yeah, nice, easy, quick, uh... Quick picks this uh, this week. It's going to be a little tough doing my numbers again. That's what's been kicking my butt the last few weeks. But we'll get it done. And I got a good feeling about this week. Everything felt good. So we'll see how it goes. Can't wait to see how the game unfolds. It's going to be uh, a little different, a little less games. So y'all have a good one. Hope this helps.